I can't believe I just came home and Jack built my hammock. There's actually no way right now. Oh my God. Why is it so sick? I have to go in it. Okay, so it turns out I actually do still have a hammock in my weird living room space right now. That was apparently not something I dreamt last night. I'm not even kidding you guys. I forgot that I ordered that last week. Like I just ordered it for like fun. Cause I really feel like this area just needs something for now before I get serious and actually order decent furniture. But hey, here I am the next morning. I'm about to go to a Fenty Beauty event. I'm really excited about that because I've never worked with them. I've never gotten PR from them or anything. So I'm really excited that I was invited. It's 92 degrees out today. So I was trying to wear something like light and sunny and summery. So I have this black long dress on that I got from Zara over the summer that I really thought that I would wear and I haven't until today. So very excited to be breaking that out. And then I think my shoes are Princess Polly. Let's see if I can stand this on my candy. Oh, I don't want to show you my boobs as much as I would love to, but nope, this angle doesn't work. Me and Avery are going together. So that's going to be fun. She's picking me up right now and then we're going to go and I'm going to vlog a little bit of that. And then I feel like it's going to be a pretty fun weekend. It's only Wednesday, but I have something fun every single day from here on out. So let's go to Fenty Beauty. I hope I meet Rihanna, even though I know she's not going to be there, but boy, do I wish she was. I need to go to the Super Bowl because she's performing at it. All right, let's see if I can harass someone there for Super Bowl tickets. back it was awesome wait let me show you what i got oh so cute the setup was phenomenal and it was at one of my favorite bars in la called bar list which is just oh it was very strange to go there on a wednesday afternoon normally i'm there on like a night anyways let's do a little haul i have fenty skin total cleanser makeup remover fat water that's so interesting i guess it's a pore refining toner serum oh a sunscreen need to start using that because i honestly do not oh my god yes a makeup brush shut up i needed a new brush so bad Wait, I didn't even see this in the bag earlier when I looked at everything. I'm pumped. A makeup sponge, also fabulous because I threw mine out earlier today. Oh my God, Rihanna's just saving the day right now. Hot cherry lip gloss, a cooling lip illuminator. Last but not least, obviously you saw the perfume that I got engraved with my name on it. That was so sick. It was really funny too because when I went up there, the girl that was working the stand was like, you can only do words of up to eight letters to get engraved onto the bottle. And I was like, okay, cool. That should be fine because my name is... I forgot it was seven letters for a second, so that's fucking awesome. But look at how beautiful that is. This might be my new go-to. They claim this is what Rihanna actually wears normally, so. Oh my God, it's just, it smells so mature and sexy, which is what I strive to be. Me as I just finished fighting with a guy right now that lasted for like five days and literally sending me over the edge and now I'm finally fine again because that's been resolved and I hate when men fucking ruin my life because it's so embarrassing and stupid, but now I'm back to being sexy and mature. God, was that humiliating, but we're not gonna talk about that. What's funny is right now, Jack is in in Vegas. He works in the music industry and he had to go there for part of his job today. He's like an assistant. He landed there at noon, ran some errands out there, and now has a flight back here in like two hours, which is so fucking funny. Like Jack has been texting me all day in Vegas and I'm so jealous. I haven't been to Vegas in months now. Oh, I love Vegas so, 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 so much. I have like an itch I need to scratch. I want to go back there so bad. But yeah, Jack's just been in Vegas all day. I'm like, is that not the most me roommate situation ever? Like I just have a roommate who just went to Vegas and back for a day for his job. Like, okay, me, me, literally fucking me. What what the hell did you do? No. Oh my god. What the <laughs> fuck are you doing? Are you throwing it off of the balcony? No, you're trying to overthrow my precious hammock. Why did you bring it onto the balcony? Don't be a nice place for it. Just think about it, you know. <laughs> I like do not know how to help. Let's just put it right here. This is actually kind of sick. I have nothing to complain about anymore. You know, I really need to go to a Halloween store right now. Whoa! Why am I in the air? Oh, you have it like off the ground. I really need to go to a Halloween store right now because Christelle's birthday party is tonight and neither of us have costumes. Yeah, you gotta pick me something out because I gotta work. I also do, but I'm taking a little break. This is called me taking a break. I've been editing all morning. I was up so early today that it genuinely alarmed Jack. I literally thought I woke her. Except with one of my shades not closed, so the sun would wake me up. We've done so much. We've been working, we moved the hammock. <laughs> fucking Vegas yesterday <laughs> for the day. I know, I told him about that. How was your Vegas experience on a scale of one to 10? Six. <laughs> Should have gone with me. 
And not for three hours total. <laughs> I know. You didn't even get to see the Michael Jackson Cirque du Soleil. Do you know what I ate? What? Jimmy John's in the airport. Ew. Okay. I honestly don't like Jimmy John's, so that's really tragic. Okay, here I am interrupting the video super fast, vlogging it on my phone because my camera's on the bed right there. And if you're wondering why, it's because it's dead. And I'm stupid. So that's just fantastic. But I wanted to say super fast that this video is sponsored by my favorite website in the whole entire world, SeatGeek. I can confidently say that almost every single concert I went to this entire year, I got my tickets from SeatGeek and my dedication to them is just unmatched at this point. And if you are not as dedicated as I am, you gotta hop on that because I have a code that will give you $20 off your entire order by just typing in C8LYN at checkout. But if you don't even know what SeatGeek is for some reason, SeatGeek is a ticketing app that makes buying tickets to any live event super simple. I have the app on my phone, which I'm filming on now. So we're gonna switch to another camera so I can show you me using it. Yeah, right off the bat, I'm already seeing so many concerts that I didn't even realize were going on. You will absolutely be catching me at the weekend at some point next weekend. And when I click that event, all of a sudden you are faced with a ton of beautiful green, yellow, and red dots. And what the dots mean is that if they're green, it's a great seat for a great price. And if it's yellow or orange, it means eh, you could do better. And if it's red, it means just don't even bother because there are so many better options if you just keep scrolling along that map. Anyways, SeatGeek recently sent me to Harry Styles and they also were the reason that me and Sarah went to the Rams versus Cowboy game last month and we had the literal best time ever. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like you should totally make an impulsive decision and just go on SeatGeek and see what events are happening around you from now till the end of the year. And I challenge you to go to at least one concert. It can be the randomest concert of all time that you wouldn't even expect yourself to go to, but find a silly little event to go to on SeatGeek and then use my code and then DM me on Instagram or comment on this video what show you end up going to or what show for like 2023 you end up buying tickets for with the code because anything helps when it comes to saving money from Taylor Swift tickets. Am I right? I'm right. Anyways, let's just jump back into the rest of the vlog now. Let's go have some fun and we're gonna go see Harry soon, I promise. Guys, Jack got a present. I look really awesome right now. I've been sitting in bed for hours, so hey. After begging, crying, kicking, screaming, <laughs> and throwing up, Vitaclean sent Jack a Vitaclean. <laughs> So everyone, this is proof that you can get anything you want if you whine enough. <laughs> and that we actually like this product. This is true fact. I'm on the same plane as all of you. Like, I know. I feel for this product. Like it's it's true. It's very true. We don't need to put this in the video, but they did not give me the rose scent. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm putting that in the video. It's okay. And suddenly we hate them. No, 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 no. <laughs> Glad I get to get ready with this tonight. Yeah, seriously. Like now I need to go shower myself now off with my Vita Clean. I feel like this is like an elf on the shelf. We just keep moving it when the other person isn't looking. And at some point I should move it back to over there, but for now I'm gonna start getting ready for Christelle's birthday party. Oh my God, I didn't even tell you guys like what I got. When I um, went to the Halloween store earlier. Put the camera back on me. <laughs> I have to go again. No, you do not. Mm. You're still working. Always. Not the giggle. <laughs> love this to do this. I really hate where my toilet is placed in my bathroom because if I don't remember to like close the lid or close my door, you can just fucking see my toilet awkwardly in the background at all times. I'm just gonna like move myself slightly to the left for now instead of having to get up and close it. But anyway, so I went to the Halloween store and tried to find the stupid fucking costume that I wanted so badly, but I couldn't find it, which made me really sad. I, instead, I'm gonna fucking DIY this shit and make it me because look at what I saw. This fabulous hat that unfortunately is so terrible in real life. This fabulous jacket and these pants. I was like, okay, no matter what I do with the jacket. It's gonna be a sleigh. All I need is the necklace and other random accessories and jackets back in my room. Anyways, I just wanted to wear a cool fucking jacket so I got this. And it was 40 bucks and the pants barely fit, so whatever. Guys, my bathroom is a big giant mess, but we are ready to go. Goo goo gaga. Ga ga. <laughs> As if that wasn't like the most predictable thing to say as you're in a baby like costume. The, the only man that is able to <laughs> say We're it. fucking floored. We're like, no way! Whoa! Me, Sarah, and Ryan are all on our way at the same time. It started 30, maybe 40 minutes ago. So I feel like a baddie. I'm gonna shake some ass. Jack's gonna rattle his rattle. And we're gonna see where the night takes us. It will take me home. I have work tomorrow. <laughs> Perfect. Here we go. How is your pizza? <laughs> I'm like, it's like, like what? bad <laughs> piss in here. Like, like why are we? As well. <laughs> why are we in here? Because Caitlin Ray had to take a pee. And so did Sarah. <laughs> I, I don't have it. to pee. I've just I don't got no friends in this city. No, you're not. Take a picture of me. Okay, 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 okay. okay. <laughs> some tea 
idea about Christelle's birthday party. Uh, the montage that I just showed you is actually not the montage you were supposed to get at all because my phone broke at her party. And then the next morning I woke up and was like, I need to get a new phone immediately, like right here, right now. So I backed up my iCloud and went to the Apple store, got my new phone and then downloaded my recent iCloud backup. And most of my videos for some reason from Christelle's birthday party were missing. And I'm really upset because they were really funny. So I just wanted to let you know that we unfortunately are all missing some fantastic content from that night. And then better yet, now we're about to go see Harry and a lot of the footage from the day after Christelle's birthday party and then the morning of me seeing Harry also got deleted. So now you're just gonna randomly see me with my friend Layla from Boston. You're definitely gonna recognize her from some old vlogs. She was staying in LA for a few days visiting and I went out with her a few hours before I saw Harry. So just had to give that little preface because without this, I feel like you would be like, what the hell is actually going on? Wait, I'm coming back for you. I wanna put you in my vlog. <gasps> oh, no, no, yes, no. yeah, I was like, wait, I like should be vlogging right now, guys. I just went to Bo for the first time in like a year I and I just met the cutest group of girls oh ever God. outside of it. I'm gonna see myself. <laughs> you are. I know, I was like, wait, I really have to go run back out there. Ah! Oh, I, love you so much. I love you too. This is Jenna. She is the fucking best. It's Jenna, right? Yes, it's Jenna. Oh my god, that would have been so bad if I forgot oh, it. Oh my god. No, I can god. I can remember I, names now. That's awesome. Holy crap. I love you too. Oh my god. Happy fucking birthday. Oh my god. Oh. Here's my outfit to go to the Melrose Trading Post. It's kind of late now. It's like 2:10. So I'm not gonna have that much time there. But I think this was the Harry Styles Fine Line Gucci collection t-shirt. So I have that. I have my parachute pants from IMGA. Random black bag from Forever 21 that I found a few weeks ago at the mall. Fantastic and Layla just went to the wrong apartment building a few streets over. I don't know how, but it happened, but she's about to come into my apartment and see my hammock. Woo! Got a doorbell? <laughs> it doesn't work. I was like pressing the doorbell and I was like, okay, you're nothing. I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> Welcome to my apartment. Hammock! I have been waiting for this moment all week. Oh no, what the fuck is this? Don't do my Am I supposed to know what's going on? Oh my God. I just got back from the trading post. Let me show you what I got, guys. First off, got these black sunglasses that I didn't even try before I bought them. Hold on, let me show you guys as I do it. I'm like kind of in my hairy outfit right now. I just came home and immediately put it on because I'm like, it's 4.30, I have to be at Jake's around six-ish, so like, let me try on my outfit. I think this is the move. It's kind of silly, but I think I like it. Anyways, got these fucking black sunglasses that I did not try before I bought them, and then I was like, wait, why didn't I try them on? But they were only $10, so I'm absolutely obsessed. Then I got this dress for 50. Might wear this tonight. I haven't even tried it on yet. I didn't try it on before I bought it, but like it's kind of giving this, but in black. And then I got a ton of prints because obviously my gallery wall, I don't even know if I'm going to use some of these. I kind of just grabbed a ton. These were all only 90 total. I think that's a good deal. Maybe it's not, but first off, Britney Spears Circus because I knew Jack would appreciate this and also like best album ever. This Elvis print, Michael Jackson. I was actually looking for a Michael Jackson print for out there anyways. And it kind of goes with some of the colors of the other prints I got too. So this, my friend found and I was like, okay, me. I totally need a girl's ass with a knife on my fucking wall. I like almost want to recreate this and then put it on the wall because my ass should be on my wall. Then I got this New York print because Jack is from New Jersey, but like I kind of just say that he's from New York and this reminded me of him. This black hat fortune telling print, Salem mask, these old cars. And then I found this random Super Bowl print. Maybe I won't use this, but it kind of works with all the colors. So we'll see. How did I not show you this yet? This Hawaiian drink menu. Oh my God, this is going up on the wall like in five seconds flat. The second that Jack gets back and can put it on the wall. I got a ton of jewelry for Halloween that I may or may not use. But yeah, I need to do my makeup and get ready now. Cause it's time to see Harry Styles. And like, I think I'm gonna wear this. It's starting to hit me that I'm seeing him and I honestly just can't wait now. Like I'm getting so fucking excited and I can't wait to see you guys. So this is gonna be so silly. And Jake has never been to a proper Harry show. He just saw him at Coachella. So I'm in for a fun night. Let's get ready. Okay, my bathroom's a fucking mess. Oh my God. Yeah, I cannot show you guys that. Never mind. I'll show you my outfit out here. Oh my God. I feel like a little 2000s fairy fucking prince. I told Jake that I would be there 20 minutes ago and I'm just leaving now in true me fashion, but that's fine. I got this dress from Jaded London over the summer and I didn't know if I was gonna keep it because I couldn't figure out how to like style it at all because without a bra, it just like looks really strange and I don't have enough boobies <laughs> to hold it up. So I'm thrilled that I finally figured out how to wear it and I'm dead ass obsessed. I'm ready to drink some tequila at Jake's apartment that he said the brand just gave us. So woo! Oh my God. Wait, this is silly. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Away. Up, up, and away. And they sent us a bottle of tequila, so let's go. It's the Rocks tequila. I know, I've never had the Rocks tequila. Hey there. Oh God. Shout out to the Rock Johnson. Ready? Oh God. If you're not drunk, ladies and gentlemen. Horrifying. The lemonade is harsher than this. <laughs> Jesus 
Fucking Christ. Come on! God, okay. Ugh. Time to hit the okay, road. Here we go. By the way, we're gonna do the same thing that I did for the Pitbull vlog. I'm just gonna put in a ton of footage from this concert to make the girlies who either didn't get to see Harry this time around or just really have post-concert depression. I'm gonna give y'all the ability to just relive a lot of the concert itself and not just give you like five second clips or like a montage and call it a day. Like, if you don't wanna see a Harry Styles concert, you're not gonna like the rest of this video. But if you wanna see a Harry Styles concert, you're welcome for the rest of this video. Enjoy. That is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. Welcome to my Super Bowl. You know what is the most ridiculous thing is tonight? What? That I am bringing you <laughs> to a Harry Styles concert. No, like, actually, that's, you should be bringing no, me to a Harry that's Styles the concert. the last fucking thing I would have ever done in my entire life. You pulled an Uno she reverse takes, on me. She takes me to the concert. Seriously. <laughs> it's never been flipped. Thanks oh my Harry. god, we made it to the Legends box. Of course we're in the Legends box. <laughs> I mean, are we surprised? Nope. I take all of them. I'm like, thank you so much, Wade, for 15 shirts. Sure. <laughs> thank you. They're all mine. And I'll be cropping all of them. <laughs> oh my god. Damn. This? I have a feeling someone's gonna have to catch me tonight because- Bro, oh. all it takes is me to like lean over like one fucking inch. Oh, Caitlin has to literally punch me one time and I'm over there. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? No, I think we have too much power tonight. Jake faking me a drink at the very Oh, that's gonna be so strong. Oh god, the bartender. You got fucking pineapple juice up in this bitch. <laughs> How are we feeling? It's insane. It's insane. It's insane. We're feeling really, we're really terrified. You have to get in the vlog. <laughs> This bitch since fucking Hawaii. We, we have both Arizona had. Arizona across the country because of you. Why would you move to Arizona? Because like <laughs> impulsive, <laughs> impulsive <laughs> decisions. Oh yeah, that's why. Impulsive <laughs> decisions. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, I don't remember telling people to start moving to Arizona. No, 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 no. <laughs> no we're not Arizona. You said Hawaii. But just, you said no, just we go. Like all but do, do we like Arizona? Yes, we, we love, love LA. There. We love LA. That's we why we're in California. Okay, period. Okay, we like Arizona and we like LA. Let's go. says, help me come out. Did you skip therapy, Serena? No, never! When this boa is raised above my head, you're out. Okay? Don't ask me why, it's just how it works.
First time I saw this motherfucker. The zombies. The, stampede. the zombies this is the are coming. Stampede scene in the Lion King. World War Z, oh, this, this is literally the stampede scene the, in the Lion King. It's the Walking Dead. <laughs> oh my god, it's that time of the night where I remember I vlogged today. Hi. We just got out of the show. There he it is. Medicine. We did fucking medicine. We just saw the love of I'm not even life. kidding you. He performed medicine. I don't really know what to do about it, <laughs> right. but it's. That's, I don't know what to say. Oh, no words. I have nothing to say right now. My, like, my voice is gone. <laughs> yep, that's about gone. it. Yep, that's I'm about it. I want ice water and that's all I have to no, say. No, seriously. The like, that's, I need 3 a.m. water. <laughs> yes, dude. I need yeah, to chug like a gone. gallon. Dude, a gallon of water would change my life right now. No. All right, we're, yes, we're all gonna go get a gallon of water right yeah, now. Yeah. That's the mission. For it's real. mission. All right, yeah. love y'all. I'm getting them the vlog. You guys are so fucking cute. Oh my god, I love you too. I'm gonna cry on the sidewalk. <laughs> Wait, I'm screaming my head off. She's wearing Crocs right now because she won a ticket before the show, like 30 minutes before. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I'm fucking obsessed. Oh my god. <laughs> You may be wondering why I'm making this face right now. It's because Julia Fox just commented on my TikTok about the fucking heatable avocado that I found in my closet. She goes, I love those. <laughs> like, of course she comments on that. Like, what the fuck? The fact that just showed up on her For You page. I literally found that in my closet while organizing it. Made a TikTok about it thinking no one would care. And Julia Fox is in my notifications on a Sunday evening. Okay, that's it. We're gonna end the video here because the next video is my Halloween vlog and it's like literally Thanksgiving. But at least I'm not doing as bad this year as I was last year because I'm pretty sure I uploaded my Halloween vlog on New Year's Eve last year. So you can't even be mad at me. I'm I'm trying my best. But I love you guys so much. And if you watch this whole entire thing, please comment horses. Because who doesn't love horses? I love you. Have a happy Thanksgiving and I will see you for the Halloween vlog very shortly. Oh, 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 oh,